guys, Sarah here from Budget Savvy Diva. So I went on a shopping haul. I went to Sur La Table, or Sur La Table, as you're supposed to say, and it was my birthday, so I spent a little bit of money, and I'm really happy with what I got. Basically, I do at least five recipes on my site a week on BudgetSavvyDiva.com. I'll put a link below directly to all my recipes. I have over 840 recipes, which is completely insane that I've done over the last three years. Basically, my dad and I get together, we bounce off ideas, we make the food. If it's good, I'll take a picture and then I publish it online for you guys to enjoy. And I have to use a lot of different pots and pans and plates and bowls to make my stuff look interesting. So whenever I get a chance, I like to go to sales and buy up stuff. I go to antiquing a lot, but the problem is I never can find bowls I can use. Like every time I go antiquing, I tell whoever I'm with, I'm like, I'm looking for bowls. Bowls, 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 but I never really find what I want. So I actually picked up three bowls this trip and I'm super excited because if you look at any of my recipes, um, I pretty much use like the same bowl all the time because I don't, uh, I like to make things in like little cute little packages to take pictures of and, um, or I use teacups because I run out of bowls. I'm like, I just used this three recipes in a row. Long story short, let's get to the bowls. All right, so the first one is a very simple bowl. It cost like, I think $7.95. I can see it on the back. It wasn't on sale or anything. It's a cereal bowl, but I just wanted a white bowl because I go over the top with my bowls when I buy them, and I just wanted a nice plain white one. I really want to make a nice, like, bit of fish with a nice, like, slaw underneath of, like, a red cabbage slaw. I think it will look really pretty. So that's my plan for that one. The next bowl I got, very excited about this purchase. If you didn't know, red is my favorite color and I really love this bowl. So, little, little fun. How much do you think this bowl cost? I'll give you five seconds. It's a bowl. I can't turn it all the way around because the price point's on it, but it's really pretty. All right, so I think probably most of you said about $5. Well, $3.99. It was on sale and I just think it's really pretty. It retailed for $7.95. And I just think it's going to photograph so nicely. Very excited about this glazed bowl. All right, then one more bowl, which what I really like about this one, and hopefully you guys like it too, it's a, nut, it's a soup bowl. And I don't think you can see it, but it has this nice rim around the edge. And it's not so much of a plain white color. It's more of an ivory, which I think will photograph really nicely with anything that I have brown or orange. Pretending I'm an expert here. I'm not really, but... From what I can remember when I take pictures, orange or brown will look really nice with an ivory color. All right, then I got into fun stuff because it was a 50% off sale of like summer things. So, it's gonna be loud for a second. I'm really sorry. I bought some silverware, but I wanna pick up these plates beforehand. So, I picked up these plates when I walked in because they were just really pretty and really inexpensive, but you can't tell that they're not like real. But now you guys are gonna know, so you'll see it and then you can call me on it. But I got this really cool yellow plate and it has lemons on it and I just thought this is cute and fun and I can see a little dessert on it or like a little cupcake. The next thing I got is <laughs> a little plate that is um, microwave safe even and it just is this nice hydrangeas? Is that the type of flower on this? But I don't have a lot of white and green and I thought this is pretty and it's a square plate. Square plates photograph really nicely because you can line up the lines on it and I tend to like that. So I really like this one and then this one retailed for $7.95 but I, I was getting it for um, I think like 50% off so I think I was picking up for about four and then I have another green plate just to kind of play off of these are limes and I just thought it was really just fun and I need more fun plates because a lot of my plates are vintage and antique and though I love them they're not really summer and then I got one more and I thought this is really really pretty another nice like glazed plate and I just think anything is going to look really nice on this especially like a pasta dish or a potato dish what do you guys think like something with tomatoes on it would look really nice but yeah 
So those were four plates. And next what I got was some silverware. <laughs> and so when I go to antique stores, it's always about bowls and silverware because I don't have that much silverware to use. And it's kind of like I want the theme of the picture. I want silverware to kind of go with that. I know, a little bit crazy. So I did pick up some things. They had like kind of like a pari little area and they had antique looking silverware. So I picked up this knife which I like that it's matte because when I take pictures I like matte silverware and then this is spoon is like almost completely matte so that just makes life a lot easier when you're trying to take pictures if it's matte and then I got a matte fork and then each one of these were was like five bucks which isn't my favorite another little tip if you're wanting to take and find like antique looking fork spoons or whatever to go to Goodwill and they tend to have a lot of stuff too I got a little paring knife. Now, I don't have large hands, so I tend to use paring knives for a lot of things more than you would think in the kitchen. And it was on sale retail for about $9.95, and it only is 6 My parents have been buying these paring knives from this store since I was a kid. So I love picking them up. They're good for a few years, and I just love them. It reminds me of my childhood and cutting up garlic. All right, so then the next thing, it's gonna be a little bit loud, sorry, is a plate, and that was $3.99 as well, and how amazing anything will look on this plate. I could make the ugliest casserole, and on this plate, it's gonna look amazing. Can you, like, just imagine? Oh, I got so excited. I think I scared some of the people in the store. I was like, oh my gosh, mine. And yeah, so there we go with that. And then I just have three more things, so I didn't go too crazy, but I bought some really interesting things. Ooh, I'm sorry, guys, about that noise. And, okay, so when I saw this, I was like, I don't care what price you are. You are coming home with me. I have a place for you. Can we just talk about this? It is, ooh, ooh, it is a miniature, like, milk jug but it is perfect for a drink. So what I like to do in my pictures is I like to set a mood with the food and I tend to try and put like a drink or um, a salt and pepper shaker behind my meal and this is gonna be perfect for drinks. It is so cute and I bought all these like paper straws and I just like cannot wait to photograph this with a paper straw and some like orange juice or punch or whatever. I'm super excited. I think this is the most excited I've been in a while. And it's about a milk jug. Little, little cray cray. All right, then the next thing I got in kind of the same section is this really cute, and it says Old Fashioned Cape Cod Glassware Company. And it is perfect for a tea light. And I think this is really gonna set the mood nicely for some of my upcoming recipes. I'm doing a new series soon, so watch out for that. And it's gonna be a perfect, perfect setting for those recipes. So it's just like this cute little hanger. And I can use it beyond that. I just had a very good idea of what I wanted and it fit the bill. And then there's only one more thing and I've been wanting to buy this for, um, well, I don't know, if you guys are interested, I can do it, but, um, I bought these king size ice cube trays, and I you like to use these for putting, like, mint, which is in the picture, or different fruits. I do a lot of infused fruit water recipes, and you can see that in my recipe section, and infused ice cubes I've been wanting to do, so I can show you some recipes with infused ice cubes if you want. I mean, it's kind of self-explanatory, but I can if you want it, just comment below. But yeah, that's everything I got. I'm really excited. It was a nice way to celebrate my birthday. And there you go. I would like to know what you like most of what I purchased. Everything I purchased was in stores. That is why there is a huge bag of stuff right behind me. And I can't wait to give that to Watson so he can play with. I would like to know what you like best of what I bought. And make sure to like and subscribe to this channel. That would be awesome. Thank you guys and bye until next time.